Hello YouTube, this is Omid and here bringing another zombie gameplay tip. In this one I'm going to be looking further into the painkiller persistent power up. Now in my comprehensive guide and other videos relating to it, I have stated multiple times that it's earnable on solo only. However, this is no longer the case, well it was never the case but I didn't know about it until now. You can earn it on co-op mode but it is considerably harder. So to earn painkiller or some people call it persistent juggernaut or super jug you have to fully bleed out about 10 to 11 times on a co-op game before you earn it uh, so this is just me earning it uh, with my friend acid buckshot thanks for helping me out we were doing it on transit where i would just deliberately kill myself with the sort of each round until i got it and it takes about 10 to 11 attempts so you know that's 10 to 11 rounds of you just killing yourself over and over again bit annoying and yeah so I can't really see why anyone would do it but you can't do it that's the main thing Um, yeah it, it is much easier to do on solo where you only have to kill yourself maybe three times I think it's because downing yourself like coins is one then reviving yourself with quick revive coins is another but you're in the same game in the same round not exactly sure how the mechanics of it work but it's much easier on solo and the effects carry from one to the other so it always makes sense just to do it on solo. Um, it only takes like as long as this commentary and you can have it done. Uh, so, this has been Omid. Thank you for watching and goodbye.